Last time they were here, the Warhope branch of Sing Australia took to AFM literally by storm. They packed the studio to capacity. They set a world record for the highest number of people in a two-way FM studio at any given time. And then they wowed us with their musical brilliance. So tonight, by popular demand, they are back to, well, to fill your hearts with joy, with musical joy. Welcome, Sing Australia. Very, very good to have you back. Like I say, I'm not making that up. It is by popular demand. I've had, we've had, we've replayed it. Has anyone caught the replay yes. of that? Yes. Saw it on YouTube. Yeah, it's on YouTube, and we've replayed it, and uh, we always get calls after after we play it. So I play it a lot because oh, yeah. it makes me look good. Uh, when we were kids, and this is a lovely uh, song bringing back the memories of all those good times, barefoot in the mud. Beautiful. a round of applause because no one else can do it, isn't it? Well done. John Williamson, is that right, Miriam? That was John Williamson. An, an original. Very nice. I like it. Like, you always seem to have plenty of Australian content with what you do. We love doing Australian songs, but we do lots of other songs as well. Yeah. Um, the, the next song we're doing happens to be by The Seekers. By The Seekers. By Tom Springfield, arranged by Chris Langdon, but the Australian group. The original Seekers sang oh, this good. one a lot. Okay. Um, so the carnival is over.
Very nice. Seekers themselves would be proud of that version, I think. Well done. And what happens to you when you sing? What what happens you know, like inside your head, inside your body? Does it uplift okay. you? Okay, yes. Well, singing is a very healthy occupation, actually. It's a good recreation because it gets your lungs pumping. It is also good um, euphorically, I guess you could say. It gets those positive hormones humming in your system mm -hmm. uh, mentally. It gives you a very positive, has a very positive effect on your outlook. So do we all agree we walk away from Thursday nights feeling a lot better about ourselves? Oh, yes. yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, that's good. And who's going to tell us just quickly, listeners who might want to take part? It doesn't matter where they are, does it, uh, Trish? Absolutely not, because we've got a choir in Port Macquarie. We've got one in Laurenton and one in Warhope. Monday nights in Port Macquarie at the uh, Senior Citizen Hall. Uh, what, where, whereabouts in Laurenton? Oh, it's at the um, oh, Arts... Arts. Yeah, School of Arts, that's right, adjacent to the Picture Theatre. And here we have a lovely hall. We meet down at the Bethel Church Hall um, on the way to t just before Timbertown. Thursday nights from 7 o'clock until 9 o'clock. And so the, the, our, our group is for people... The only prerequisite is that you, you need to love singing mm. and have a good time. So that's it. Um, so it's fantastic because once you get involved with all these groups of people that sing, you find out about all this other wonderful stuff that happens around the Hastings like what Miriam's doing on the 9th mm. and so it's just fabulous so families, people, uh, kids, anyone who likes to sing, they can just That's turn up right. to those places we mentioned before. I started yeah? in Port. Mm -hmm. There you go. Three yes. years ago. Yep. And you're enjoying um, it very and much? I am um, fantastic. Oh good. Because I'm multilingual, we travel overseas. Yep. If you like. 